things that I think of when it comes to boat racing. There's the super boring sailboat stuff, and then there's the powerboat racing that's really only fun to watch when there's epic crashes. And then there's the racing they do in Cobra Triangle on the good old NES. I mean, this is powerboat racing to the extreme! We're talking the kind of stuff you only see in James Bond. I mean, each stage is a mad dash to the finish and there's all sorts of bad stuff flying at you with your tricked out boat. I mean, it is crazy. I mean, it starts off with just other boats and some logs floating down a river, but then there's icebergs, planes, freaking UFOs. It's like a never ending barrage of water death. And your boat, I mean, this is like the king of all boats. It's so sleek and fast and nimble and full of firepower, anyone would feel safe in it. Except for that whole never-ending barrage of water death thing happening. Anyways, I know that early on it just seems like another boat with a gun. But when push comes to shove, this red rocket will show you what she can really do. Get a couple power-ups and you'll have a little extra pep in your step. And get this, hold for dramatic effect, you'll have the spreader. Hell yes! So when you're trying to jump a bunch of waterfalls, dispose of mines, or evade certain death, you're going to be glad this is the boat you're in. Now, in addition to owning boat face, every few levels or so, there's this giant monster that needs to be decimated, like a giant squid or a freaking sea dragon that shoots balls of flames from its mouth, and a giant enemy crab. Insert 2006 PS3 joke here. Now, but seriously, those things will beat the crap out of you if you don't kill them quick enough. But if you do kill them, your boat has a freaking propeller in it that flies you to the next area. I mean, this boat has everything. You know, but now that I think of it, Cobra Triangle is kind of like the RC Pro on the boats, except you're not really racing so much as you are destroying everything. And wouldn't you know it, both games were made by the greatness that is rare. Now, definitely a good thing. If you like RC Pro, you're gonna love Cobra Triangle. It's exactly what the NES is all about.